if you have a really large book with lots of text or if you're writing a term paper or an essay and you want to make stylistic changes throughout the entire document quickly, then this is the way to do it. Here I've got a document. It's about a thousand words, lots of text. I've got some chapter headings in here. I've got different sections, chapter one, chapter two, chapter three, and I have a title up here at the top. What I can do is I can change the styles inside of this document pretty easily. So the first thing I'm gonna do is highlight my chapter. I've got three chapters, and I'm gonna make this chapter into a style. Okay, so I'm gonna go up here to the top under styles. I've got my chapter one highlighted. I'm gonna go down arrow. I'm gonna click create style. From here, I'm gonna type in the word chapter and I'm going to click okay. So now this text, when I highlight it, you'll see it comes up as chapter style. Now the chapter style, it happens to look, the font and the text size happens to look exactly like the rest of the document, but we're gonna change that right now. I would like my chapter one to look a bit different. So I'm gonna scroll on down, find a cool font. Here I'm gonna use Gothic. I'm gonna make it nice and big, let's say. I'll even underline it and bold it. So there's all sorts of changes I've made to it. So there is my chapter style. Now if I want to update the style to match this font that I've just created, I go up to the style, I right click, and I click update chapter to match the selection. And now you'll see the style itself has now changed. It's now become that big underlined font. Now when I scroll on down to chapter two, I highlight that and I click the chapter style, it instantly updates. So you can go through your book and you can make all your chapters the exact same and hey, that looks great. Now let's fast forward and say you're all done the book and you've got a whole bunch of chapters written and you're like, oh no, I wanna change the way all of my chapter headings look. Oh, but I don't wanna go through 30 or 40 chapters. That's gonna take me all day. What you can do is just pick one, highlight it. So now my chapter style is highlighted and I'm going to make it whatever I want. Let's say I wanna make it red font, not bolded, not underlined. So here I'm gonna pick Futura. Okay, so there, that's what I want my chapter headings to look like. You'll see chapter two below is not changed, but chapter one is. I simply go up to the top, right click on the style, update chapter to match selection, and you'll see chapter two below has now instantly changed. In fact, all of my chapter headings have instantly changed. You can do this with your normal font inside your document. So let's say, for example, you wanna change all this font and you've got hundreds of pages of text and you're like, oh, I wanna indent, I wanna change, that's gonna be a lot of work. Okay, what you do is you highlight one paragraph, let's say, and this is normal. You've got it all set as normal. So all of this is sitting under normal. I'm gonna highlight the first paragraph only. I'm gonna indent it, let's say. So I'll go here to paragraph and I'll go to, uh, let's say you wanna make the line spacing a bit more. And let's say you wanna change the indent. So you've got indentation here on the left-hand side. And let's say you wanna indent it uh, two inches. And let's say you wanna do the first line even more five inches. Okay, you click okay. So that's now what your paragraph looks like. Go up to normal and click update normal to let match selection and you'll see the entire document, hundreds of pages have now been updated to whatever the normal style is that you've now indicated. I hope you found this helpful. Microsoft Word is very powerful. Here's another video that hopefully you'll enjoy.